hello families welcome back to the channel thank you so much for clicking if this is your first time do us a favor by liking the video and subscribe to our channel let us enjoy this beautiful morning together this comment says my question is that if your two years contract is finished and you want to go back home for vacation and you want to go back to your company again does the company provide visa and tickets again okay if we all know that when you come here, they will do it two years for you. So when you are about to go home for vacation, you need to talk to the company. So that if you want to come back, they will extend your uh, resident permits. Okay. Let them extend it so that you will talk to the company. Maybe they should add something related to your salary. If agreement is done, now they will buy you the ticket in and out. Okay. They will buy the ticket in and out. So when you go for your vacation... Maybe they'll give you like two months. So after the two months is done and then you are coming back, no need to buy any ticket. And then the visa, no need for any new visa again because most at times, some of us here are confused. And it is good that you ask. If you don't know, you ask. So that is it, okay? So if you are coming back, you only need your ticket. That's all, no more visa because the ikama that you are holding, like you already have extra time in Kuwait here, okay? You already have it, so there's no need for you to reapply another visa before coming. So right now, so when you are traveling back home, you know at first, um, our visa is on our passport. But right now, our visa is on our ikama. So if you are traveling back home now and you are not having the ikama when you reach at the airport, no way that you can travel. So you need to have your ikama plus your passport. Okay, so that is it. So you only talk to the company, then they extend it. Another comment here too said, Hello, good evening, my dear friend. I have paid for visa, but the agent is telling me that the company need to send visa before I can't be able to come. <laughs> yes, yes, my dear. That is how it works. Okay. So if you have paid the money for your visa, not that the agent is the one who is selling the visa. No, it is the company who need to provide you the visa for you to come. Okay. So after you got the visa, you have to take it to your embassy okay the kuwait embassy in your country for visa stamping so after your visa is done stamping okay then you are ready to travel okay so before you even go for the visa stamping you do your medical police report and the necessary documents you have to provide them all to the embassy for visa stamping okay <laughs> so that is how it works so the agent does not collect your money without giving your visa don't think it in that way yeah so if I've watched this point, I really appreciate it a lot. Sometimes some of us may think, oh, there's this small, small questions. Maybe there's no need to ask. Ask. If you don't know anything, ask. Whatever. Only if I have knowledge about it, I will share with all of us. So, yeah, that is it. It was early morning around 11, but see the weather. See you guys in the next video. Bye for now.